So I've got the return valve here, which is set to about a quarter of a turn. I've got my Eheim compact in the bottom there, 3000, which again is set to the basic, I don't know if you can see it there, but it's set right to the lowest possible value on the, uh, on the pump. And I've also compounded that with the uh, closing the ball valve up to the return to the tank by, again, about a quarter of a turn. So restricted flow in, restricted flow coming out. Got about happy with the water level and the sump, with it raising about another inch or so. Um, and I'm happy now with the water level in the top tank. Um, I've put a, a hole, see there with the torch, put a hole there, which is just where I want it to be, just slightly below the water level is my fail safe. So when the um, it's a power cut, it uh, creates a, it breaks the siphon and, and uh, protects the tank. So the question is, how do I stop that gurgling in the, uh, in the overflow? Okay, cheers guys.